good morning. I just <clears throat> been home a couple of days now from my trip. Got back in my workshop yesterday. Truck broke down. I'm not unhappy about my situation. Uh, still got my still got my bike I can ride while my truck is probably gone. Big transmission blowout. I've been here before enough times. Welcome, Jason Wren. Good to see you this morning. Keith King. Uh, about 20 minutes ago, I found out Jake's, Jake Phelps passed away. And <clears throat> uh, good morning. And uh, yeah, truck is wicked fact. Yeah, I was on a was on a uh, FaceTime with Jason Rand when that happened. Michael, good morning. Uh, just found out Jake Phelps passed away. Um, didn't know yesterday. Good morning, Jason Schlager. Uh, don't like to do videos off the cuff. I got some water boiling over here, making myself some some Elevate Smart Coffee that I got from Jennifer Michelle Miller. Gonna enjoy a cup of that while we have our chat this morning. So, uh, one thing I don't like is capitalizing on events, but I uh, wanted to make a post in recognition of the fact that uh, Jake Phelps passed away. I uh, have seen Jake in action over the years, been openly, legitimately, and unregrettably crit critical of Jake's professional deal. And I've always been happy to hear that uh, close up and in person, there was a person there that had a real tender side, was a very sweet person at times. I think it's probably true of all of us. I will always remain openly critical of uh, Jake's legacy in skateboarding. He empowered the bully. He made it hard for many inner children to enjoy rolling on a skateboard. He enforced a culture of closed borders to uh, the ungifted, the fat, the feminine. And um, that's a bad professional legacy. Thanks be to God, there's more to a life than a professional legacy that uh, every one of us, despite what we are publicly, we're, we're something else privately. And uh, I'm so sad that Jake passed. Just yesterday, I was involved in a thread talking about a lot of Jake's bad behavior. And my, I was, my public words were, I've got a hug for Jake, you know, no matter what. And I didn't know that he passed away yesterday. In fact, I don't even know if I did the timeline. I might have been saying it just in the hour before he passed away. And... Um, I'm, uh, I'm, I'm gutted. We're all gutted. And um, Jake was an important, influential, powerful person in the world of skateboarding and the world of skateboarding media. And as such, he he held the keys of the kingdom, and he closed those doors against a lot of people, and he opened those doors for other people. And uh, I think one of the worst things we can do is uh, sugarcoat things and be anything but true in our, you know, sober assessment of life's shortness and each other, in our lives' impact. So I'm sad that Jake passed away. Seems like he had a lot of unresolved stuff. And uh, I wish for all of you that you would resolve stuff and that we would resolve stuff while we live still. Makes me think of uh, several people with whom I'd like to reconcile before I pass this earth. And uh, I hope everybody uh, has a beautiful day, values what we have, and um, that we can uh, not turn away from the deeper lessons of life. Um, for those of you just joining, I just found out that Jake Phelps passed away sometime yesterday, I guess, 
what, what's today? Friday, yeah. And um, I'm, I'm sad. We all should be sad. But we shouldn't sugarcoat it. Jake's, Jake was a... He was in many ways a professional bully. And he hurt a lot of people's chances of enjoying skateboarding through his professional work. And I'll never back off that critique. But every one of us is more than what we do professionally. And that's true when what we do professionally is poor. And it's true when what we do professionally is well done. And uh, let's always consider each other more deeply than just um, the public sphere and what other people think of us. And um, let's try and love one another today. Best we know, best we can. Let's try and love one another. Love your neighbor. Try loving your enemy. Try giving them a listen. Um, that's the depth. Well, I'm going to be starting this day, getting things going once again, and um, one of those days when you feel cosmically challenged, and uh, I hope everybody can springboard off this sad news into something that's uh, beautiful. Um, I think that's what's important. We should we should push, push off of sad news into the depths of... of uh, Loving one another. It's not weak. It's strong. Love overcomes all things. So, I'm going to sign off here and start my day. And I'll, I'll check back in with you, friends, later. Peace be with your spirits. And uh, I'll be back at you. More on Dave. I love you, bro.